What's up, guys? We're back with another episode. Um, today we're gonna be reacting to the two uh, February eighth, twenty twenty three Nintendo Direct. Um, it's gonna be. It's actually live right now. It's probably going actually, still going. I just just got home and yeah, I just couldn't catch it in time in order to do this intro and stuff. And it, yeah, it's, as we speak, it is going right now. But first, uh, just want to note my predictions here. Um, yeah, this, these are my. Um, predictions. Uh, you can't see that one actually. Um, but yeah, th these are my predictions. Um, I talked about some of these in my previous video, which I released uh, today actually. And it's kind of sucks because I was planning to release that video later on in the week, but decided to do the direct side. So I had to get that out before they did the direct because there might be some new games that completely nullify my, my video. And if you haven't watched that, please do. Yeah, here's some of them. I expect Metroid Prime 4, uh, some Zelda stuff, Donkey Kong, Switch Pro, even though there's some stuff I know like pro will probably not happen, but I just put them on here just for the sake of them. Now with that out of the way, let's uh, get to the direct here. Let's go. Here we go. Or scam it it's Pikmin. It's totally Pikmin, right? It's Pikmin calling it. Yep, Pikmin 4. Let's go. I already got one of those bingo cards wiped off. Ooh, I'm excited. I I like I haven't played any Pikmin before. I was considering playing Pikmin 3 Deluxe. But I played the like demo and I didn't really uh like it. But I'll definitely try to play this one. What do we got here? It's who is that? That is a new character. Looks a lot like the third one. Looks a little cleaner. I like it. Red Pikmin, of course. Got the good old red, yellow, and blue. Looks a little rough, but I know it's still early in development. Cool though, there's some sort of garden. I like it. Looks very similar. Who is this? Ice Pikmin. Looks a lot like a rock. Cool. Wow. Definitely interested in playing this. I don't know how it's that much different than the third one, but... Ooh, is this some sort of dog? Oh. <laughs> Interesting. We saw some other new characters there, I think. Again, like other than ooh, who's that? Uh, it's a big boss. Got some cave areas that are looking really good. Yeah, again, the game looks pretty good. I know it's still early in development, so some things still look rough. Um, but yeah, it looks great. I'm liking it. It's uh, like uncharacteristic. They don't usually show this much of a game that early. Oh, what is this? Some sort of blood moon. Ooh, we got a release date. Uh, September? No, August. That's no July. <laughs> It's July. Wow, that was quick. I'm Shinya Takahashi. Hello. I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. Huh? Okay. That was the latest trailer for Pikmin 4. Indeed it was. A dog-like creature was spotted. What kinds of things will it show us? Hmm. Please look forward to more information. I don't know. The guy looks kind of weird. Let's 
see our first cool dog, I guess. Nintendo Switch headlines. Here we go. This new hero is a real gem. Introducing Oh, I called it. I knew there would be uh another Xenoblade DLC thing. It's another thing checked off. Let's go. Checked off the bingo card. Yeah, I haven't played a Xenoblade 3. Um, so this doesn't really apply. I, I would like to play it one day, though. One of the games. It just doesn't look too interesting. Doesn't look like the type of thing I would like. Also cool. Seems like there's a new story. Whoa! This is this an old Sega IP? Yeah. I I know that guy from like Sonic Tennis. <laughs> One of those obscure games where they put Sega IPs in them. Yeah, that's cool. I probably won't play it. But yeah, it's cool that it's still relevant, kind of. <laughs> It's quite a weird game. Very cool. I probably won't get this because it kind of reminds me of Just Dance. I don't like that game. Delve into these dark worlds. Dracula's Castle beckons in this new paid DLC. Ooh, I like the artwork. The the uh, thing. The um, pixel art looks really good. Is this like a mainline game? I might, I might consider getting it because I've never played any of them. That looks cool. It's a new game. Maybe not. That this is cool though. If this is a new game, I might consider getting it. That looks cool. I've always wanted to play those. Enter a new grid in this narrative puzzle adventure set within the Tron universe. Tron. Isn't that dangerous truths and retrieve what was lost as you navigate through a perilous world. This is cool. I know it. I think I know what Tron is. It's like that weird game. The entire server. Tron. It's like a launches first for console Telltale game. Ooh, I do like I like car chasing games. Is this interesting? Maybe? I don't know. It's an anime. Great. <laughs> no, I, I don't think this is a game I would like. Well, it's, it's like an open world. That's cool. Uh, it's an RPG. Never mind. <laughs> and it has guns. I like the music. I will say the music's pretty good. This music's really making me want to play it, but I probably won't. I might listen to this track later. Deca Police. How was that? Next, please take a look at this. Oh, something interesting. Splatoon 3, yes! Called this too. Got some DLC. What do we got here? Is this a new hub area? I wouldn't know. I, I haven't played the game. I I've really was really tempted to buy it, um, but I, I decided not to. Some sort of subway. It's probably like new maps and stuff. I think they said that there would be some. Is this new? It looks pretty new. Got some weird guys. Expansion pass. You know, I thought they would name it something cool. Encopolis. Introducing the Splatoon 3 expansion pack. Splat-tastic place from the original Splatoon. Oh yeah, that's from the original Splatoon. That's cool that they added that. This is wow. It's, got some it's cool that they, uh... Weapons and gear. They did that. Spot a few familiar faces alongside new shopkeepers. That's cool. I'm glad they, like, made that, like, a reference. So shop is it some story thing, maybe? It looks... Uh, lore. <laughs> hmm. 
I'll have to see what people think of this. Because uh, I'm not an expert at Splatoon or anything. I've always wanted to play them, but I've never gotten around to it. Wave one, oh, that's Wave 2, okay. I thought they would do like something from Splatoon 2 as the Wave 2. That's cool. Wait, this is today? Is the Wave 1, like, out? Wow. Maybe it is. That is not me. You bet. Please look forward to more information about Splatoon 3 in the future. Let's see some more Nintendo Switch headlines. Adventure awaits Mickey and friends on Illusion Island. Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse, Donald Duck, and Goofy. Hmm. Embark on a Looks like a cool game. Three magic it's animated. And save the mysterious island of Mana. Run. Whoa. It's like a cool 2D 2D game. I like it. It's like Cuphead. But like Disney vibes. This is a very unique art style that I like. And glide through the air to Nintendo Switch July 28. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Very cool. I might get that game. Hey, I knew there'd be Fire Emblem. I knew it. I knew there'd be DLC. This is just a no-brainer. Even though like no one really plays the game. I like all the DLC like stuff that they don't just let the game, you know, have its own thing. But they're like actually like the same Nintendo nowadays just like pumping out DLC left and right. And I like it. A world a riveting soundtrack by Celeste composer Lena Rain. Celeste Composer. Also creator of Pig Step. <laughs> hey, I I I really want to play this game. This looks really interesting. I wanna I wanna play this game. Nice. Okay. Yes. 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 I am gonna get that. Eight new stories await. Which path? I really want to try it out. See if I like it. I've always wanted to play like a game like this, so I think this will be a good one to try out. Hey, it's this guy. Who's this guy? I've seen this guy before. This is Bandai Namico. Yeah. Space? <laughs> new features include very uh. Young King of all cosmos in five new challenges. It's a very interesting game. I've never played it, but it's always it's always looked um cool. <laughs> I'm trying to think of a word to describe it. It's like interesting, unique, unique. It's a unique game. What is this? This looks interesting. It's like Mario Striker is done right. Even it's even called Strikers. Yes, this looks cool. I like the soundtrack too. I'm look into this one. Oh, this is... It's like one of those games. I don't know. Actually, this... By drawing the map as you explore, you can progress even further. This looks... Actually... That... That's... Intriguing. I kinda like that. It's... Ah, uh, it's an RPG. Of course it's an RPG. Because everything has to be an RPG. But the, the exploring element looked very interesting. It's very intriguing. Like the simple aspect of it, and then you throw in all these RPG things, and nah. Nah. Oh, I should I know. Okay. I knew I should have predicted this. This would be in it. Uh, I, I, I remember when this was announced in like 2021, and I, and I really want to get this. 
This game was uh, one of the games that was pushed back a lot. But yeah, I really want to play this. This looks really cool. I'm going to look into that one. I should be writing these down. I'm not going to remember which ones I like. Hey, it's Kirby. Call it. A new story will unfold in the Kirby's Ooh. return to Dreamland. Deluxe new story. Game. Magic points by defeating enemies. Oh, that's cool. It's a very unique spin on it. I like it. Can be restored. On the Kirby, um, like gameplay. I like that. Like it, it won't start out like easy. That'll be cool. Seems like there's bosses too. This is very cool. I wonder if you can use like copy abilities. But I guess his powers are just good enough for that. Very cool. I don't know if I'm gonna get this game. It doesn't look like a game that I would want to play right now. You know how it is, like you get into the mood to play a game is when you really want to play the game. It looks cool though. It looks really good. I'm interested to see how this um, goes over with community. We hope you're looking forward to the new story in Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe. I am. Next, here's some news about Nintendo Switch Online. Oh, Switch Online stuff. Called this, called this, called this. I'm calling it. What is it? Game Boy, let's go! Yes! Oh my goodness. This is incredible. It's Mario Land 2. Oh, please don't be another tier of like... It's gonna be another tier of pain. Oh, and please, just include it with the... Include it with the original. Please, oh, it's Tetris. Oh my goodness. Please, just don't, don't, don't ruin this by overpricing it, please. This is just such a good moment. Yeah, Mario Land 2. You better include Mario Land 1. I, I'm gonna stay. Oh, yeah, Link's Awakening, yep, of course. Oh my goodness, it's in color too, I like it. They better... This is such, so incredible. I can't wait for to play these. Game and watch gallery. Got game and watch. Game and watch cool. It's not Do Do Donkey Kong. The new nightmare. Solve a murder mystery on the supernatural Shadow Island. Oh my gosh! It's Metro Two. Let's go! I love this. Switch Online just got a whole lot better. Mario Land Three. Okay. Is there a, is there a Mario Land One? If you're gonna include Mario Land Three, you gotta include Mario Land One, surely. Kirby, of course. I I am I haven't played this game. I really want to. I like Kirby. Yep. No, there wasn't. Oh, yeah, there's different filters. Oh, that that is bright. It's actually backlight. <laughs> but. Uh, they didn't include more lands. More games will be added in the future. And there's there's some games. I have Tilt and Tumble actually, surprisingly. And, and no more lands. Oh my gosh, Game Boy Advance games. Oh my gosh, this is insane. Yes, yes, I've been wanting to play this game too. This is Minish Cap, right? Oh my goodness, I I am loving this. Super Mario yes. I just got this game too, because I didn't think it would be added so soon on the, the Wii U eShop. Yes. Game Boy Advance, everyone's going to be so happy. Please, please don't be, it's going to be another tier. We're gonna, it's going to be like a Game Boy tier, where you have to pay extra. Just, it's so overpriced, but... Yes, I also got this game because I didn't think it would be added so soon. And this game. Actually, I played this game before a while ago, actually. I never beat it, because I just got a little burnt out playing it. Minish Cap, I really want to play this. This looks awesome. 
I'm so glad I waited, like, didn't go on that spree of buying Game Boy Advance games on the Wii U. Perfect! Oh my goodness! And the fusion! Amazing mirror! Oh my goodness. This is, this is insane. Okay, what's the price? Let's, oh, you can play Game Boy already! Okay, I think it's just included in the expansion. Hey, <laughs> that's nice though. Select Game Boy title. It makes it actually worth it. Will be playable on Nintendo it's so good. I'm so glad they did that. that Nintendo Direct, it's, I know it's been rumored for a while, but that, that's insane. I love it. It's so good. Please look forward to more information about Nintendo Switch Online and Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack. Yes. Switch Online is actually becoming a good service. I'm loving it. Oh. Metroid Prime. Guys, it's Metroid Prime. It's Metroid Prime. Oh my gosh. I'm getting this game. I gotta get this game. Oh, it looks so good. Oh my goodness. That looks so much better. It's Metroid Prime. Oh my gosh, it looks so good, guys. Guys, it looks so good. Oh my goodness, this is this is cool. I'm so glad they remastered. I am I'm a bit disappointed. But it looks like a remastered game. Like everything was made from the ground up, maybe? It looks awesome. I'm excited. I'm definitely gonna play this game. I'm definitely gonna play this game. This is awesome. I remastered, yeah. I am a bit disappointed that they didn't do two and three, but that is good enough for me. I love that. Yes. Let's go. I, I predicted Metroid Prime 4 news and not Metroid Prime Remastered. I didn't think they would do this game, honestly. Oh my goodness, it looks it looks so good. Visors? Oh yeah, there's like cool stuff like that, yeah. That's cool. I, I really want this game. I know a lot of people are going to be happy right now. That this is such a good direct so far. Way better than that September one from last year. This looks so good. Oh yeah, let's go. Wow. I like that they had to make that note. Out there. Doing that. <laughs> I love it. Digital? Today? Today? Oh my goodness. Physical version 22nd. That, it's probably 60 bucks, so I'm probably just gonna wait to the physical version. That... I can't get over that. That They did Metroid Prime Remastered. I can't believe they did that. I did not expect them to. Well, hopefully by remaking that game, they will learn more about how to make Metroid Prime 4. <laughs> I hope people are going to be really happy with that. Some, uh, Armin game? I think this is at the last Direct, too. I don't even remember anymore. There's so many Armin games. It's just, uh... Uh, Animal Crossing. Very similar. Oh, there's... Dragon. <laughs> Looks like a very slow game. I don't know if I would like this. This is a very weird trailer. <laughs> anyway, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, let's go! Wait for predicted it. What is this? Yoshi's Island! <gasps> this was leaked! Oh my goodness, that's such a good track! Oh my gosh, it looks beautiful. That looks beautiful. This looks like up to par with like... Oh my goodness. Oh, and the soundtrack. This was leaked in Mario Kart Deluxe. Bird! They included new characters! 
Birdo! What? Since when did this? Since when did they do this? Oh my gosh, this is. This is insane. They, they only revealed one track, but it's such a good. They're actually listening. I am, I am surprised. Wow. I can't believe that. Nintendo, you're really pulling through here with the waves. Oh, Minecraft, wait, Minecraft Legends, I did see that. Oh my gosh. They just revealed the Yoshi's Islands. I did not, I thought... Hey, right, Minecraft Legends, yep. I'm gonna de definitely play this game. Um, yeah, they just revealed, um... Yoshi's Island, I didn't think that was a real track. It was leaked in the Mario Kart Tour. And I just thought of nothing much of it, because... Like, surely they're not gonna... Like, harken back to one of their IPs, but, like, that's not even Mario, but... That's cool that they did that. That looks awesome, by the way. That looks up to par with one of the Nitro tracks, almost. From the trailer, anyway. Thank you for staying with us so far. No problem. It's been awesome. Really? Has it been that long already? Wow, it has. 45 minutes. Surely it's Tears of the Kingdom. It is. Oh. What is that? That's a new enemy. Looks cool. Oh. Got some towers. Some islands. I love the music. It's very mysterious. It has, it has me with goosebumps. What are those guys? Lysophos? Ooh. One man. Who is talking? No survivors. Oh my goodness, this is insane. What is going on? Everyone's super evil. Oh. Look, the map looks largely unchanged, I will say. Maybe it'll change over time. Oh, that's a boss. Let's go. Oh, there's Ganon. Link, I'm not sure you'll be able to stop him. Oh, here we go. Here's the trailer. Here's the trailer. Oh, that's that's a OP. Oh, we got some new stuff. Some new wands. What is that? Oh yeah, it's on his like hands. Oh, they've got a car. Limp. Oh, we got some like vehicles. I like that. We got some stuff falling down. Very. I like the music. I will say that was pretty good. Um. Whoa. Please, lend him your power. Oh. Awesome. I was expecting a little longer of trailer, but I like it. Creators, let's go. Are they going to talk about how it's $70? Whoa. Cool. I don't know if I'll get that. <gasps> I must have that. <laughs> no, I stopped hunting for Amiibo. I gotta... Can't get back into that. That was not fun. I am. One more thing. No. No Mario, other than that Mario Kart. Let's go. Wow, it's been 45 minutes already. That did not feel that long. <laughs> Thanks. Well, um... Yeah. So, uh, our predictions here... We can do a little... Um, thank you. We got, we got the free space. Uh, we picked in four. Yep. Uh, new games. Let's go. Uh, no Mario Slugger, sadly. We got this. And that. I should have predicted, like, Metroid news. I should be broader. Did you get, did you get that? Uh, yep. Fox Fest. 
play floor. No Sonic Frontiers. Um, no, like, brand new Zelda projects. I don't think so, yeah. Um, no Mario movie news. No new Mario games, sadly. I don't know. I, they might actually be done with the Strikers stuff. I just didn't, uh... Man, okay. Do we count Tears of the Kingdom? I know it's like... <sighs> I don't know. I expected Mario Rabbit stuff. Yeah, Fire Emblem. And we didn't get Wind Waker. Look at that. That's so bad. Should have reordered these. Yeah, that's it. Um, do we do we count this? You know, uh, it's my it's my bingo card. I'm counting it. We're counting Tears of the Kingdom, a new Zelda game. Yeah, look at that, beautiful. Saving. I I, I that was like a longer um, direct. Yeah, that, I felt really short, honestly. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. I was having a really good time doing that. Metroid, Mario Kart, uh, NSO, and Tears of the Kingdom are the big, the big ones. And we also got some like Kirby and Pikmin. Yeah, that's like, a lot of things to look forward to in 2023. Wow, I, th I thought this would be like the year where they start to, you know, are more laid back on their games as and my predictions are. My, my predictions on Mario games seem to be coming true. There doesn't seem to be a lot of Mario stuff, but um, yeah, they really pulled it together with this direct. This is definitely one of the better, greater directs. And I'm interested to see what other people have to think about it. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Are you excited for any of these games? Um, so yeah. Peace out, guys. Bye.